What is up, you guys? What is up, you guys? Man, dude, I'm telling you, man, I love YouTube. I love YouTube. I love YouTube. Let that go through the algorithm. Let that go through the algorithm. I freaking love YouTube. Shout out to YouTube. Dude, I'm telling you, man, you guys better go start making some videos. You guys better go start laying down some content and keep it real. Keep it real. Keep it authentic. Keep it you. What is your passion? What are you excited about? What are you fired up about? What do you do for work? What's your talent? What's your skill? What's your profession? What's your business occupation? Are you a student? Like, it don't matter how old you are. It does not matter what country you live in. Who the heck are you? What do you like to do? And, 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 and is there an audience of people out there in internet land that happen to like the same type of thing, right? If you're into baking, could you find other communities online, Facebook groups, Instagram, YouTube channels? Can you find people that also love to bake? If you love to cook Mexican food, is it possible to reach out and find different Facebook groups of people that love to cook Mexican food and are all, are all about building community and sharing recipes? It doesn't matter what it is, dude. Like It does not matter. Over here, what I'm trying to talk about is internet marketing, affiliate marketing, building a social media agency. That's what I do full-time. That's what I've been doing since 2016, hustling, grinding getting clients right and 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 then and then branching out and starting different streams of income from that you know what i mean like you got to constantly be 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 evolving right but it's like dude shout out to freaking youtube like it is no joke man it took me a little over and only because in the beginning i wasn't consistent at all like i started this youtube channel you can go look at my videos you can go look at the in fact dude i'm going to just let's just might as well do this now. Let's go to the videos and let's go to the very, 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 very first one, which shouldn't be that long ago, which actually it is, but it's not. I mean, I didn't, I'm at like over 300 videos, which isn't nothing, man. You look at some of these people, dude, thousands of videos, you know, hundreds of thousands of, of subscribers. I'm telling you, dude, if you're not building a YouTube channel, um, this is one year ago but I know I have videos older than that, older than one, older than one um, year ago. Let me go to this, to this section. But it's like, dude, when I started, man, when I started, okay, making videos, putting videos up, talking about the same stuff, man. I've been fired up about, about building a business for 20 plus years. I've been fired up about the internet for freaking, um, for, for 20 years. I've been, you know, trying to crack the code online, building businesses offline. And then in 2016, started a, a, a social media agency and started going after clients and helping them with their social media marketing and, and Facebook advertising, right? But this YouTube channel, look, man, this YouTube channel, I started like in, like in late, late, um, 2017. Dang, dude, I wish I could freaking, um, oh, here we go. This shouldn't take that that long. Look, dude. Let's go one more click. Yeah, I have like a little over 300 videos, dude. And, and watch. This is... This is the first um the first one which was sometime in 2017 look june 20 yeah it was this one dude that's the very last very first one june 18 that's when i started my channel dude didn't know what the hell I, what the hell i was doing i still don't know what the hell i'm doing um but i'm gonna tell you what the hell what what i do know i'm gonna i'm gonna tell you that 
I, I'm going to tell you the, exactly how I feel when that money is deposited in my bank account, which it was just deposited in my bank account. And that's the very first time I ever, this is the very first time I got this email this morning, man. Look, dude, I ain't playing. I get this email this morning, 6.45 a.m. in the morning. Today, you know, today, freaking 6.45, I get this email from Google Payments. I'm like, okay, check your recent payment. We sent a payment for your AdSense pub. That's the account. And then um, it tells me to sign in. So I signed in. And then I looked at this, and it was a check for $291. Are you freaking kidding me, dude? I cut a video a couple of days ago regarding that number and regarding me expecting it. And I was flipping out at that point. I was like, dude, are you kidding me? And I'm saying that right now. Dude, are you kidding me? Like for me to just talk some shit online with you guys, stuff I'm fired up about, stuff I'm already doing for myself, how I'm simply documenting a piece of my, my life, my business side of it all, right? Like it's like, dude, taking people through tutorials. Like, that's what I'm saying. What can you guys do? What can you teach me? What are you good at? What's your passion? What's your background? Are you a freaking coach? Are you a consultant? Are you a um, real estate agent? Are you a um, entrepreneur? Are you a um, life coach? Are you a yoga instructor? Are you freaking, are you fired up about baking? Are you fired up about cooking? Are you fired up about fitness? You know, shout out to my boy out there. Like, Fire, fired up about fitness, man. Fire, are you fired up about fitness? And, and, and now you want to go build a community? Start talking about that stuff. Start putting together simple YouTube videos. Look at my, my stuff, man. Nothing fancy. I don't know how to edit nothing. I don't know how to add all this, all, add all the fancy stuff, man. I just don't. What I'm telling you right now, man, I am fired up for YouTube because someone like me on a random ass shoe budget type of deal throwing some shit out there and, and seeing, you know, what, what sticks. I finally, my first video went up in 2017. I wasn't consistent at all putting them up in the end of 2017. And then into 2018, I still wasn't that consistent. Um, and what I mean by consistent putting, let's just say three videos a week up, three videos a week up, three video, three videos per week. Like it's clockwork. I wasn't doing that in 2018. Um, I didn't start doing that until like the end of 2019. So it's like, dude, I'm telling you, even with that, not going as fast as far as content and production and, 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 and just, and just keeping it niche, keeping it and just building my little audience. You know, it's like, dude, I don't need all you guys shit. Most of you aren't even going to subscribe. It's all good. I don't need you all. The small percentage of an audience that you'll get, that you can get, that you can, that you can get that you can literally build a relationship with and grab, you know, a hold of and, and get, and, and, and get the attention of at the end of the day, it doesn't take that many, man. It doesn't take, take that many, a, a guy like me that doesn't even know what he's doing on YouTube. This is my first check. I've been dropping videos since 2017. You have to, first of all, you have to have a thousand subscribers. I hit a thousand subscribers probably like a couple months ago, not that long. So now I'm, you know, a little above a thousand, depending on when you're watching this, you know, I'm at, you know, freaking not that high, man. I'm at like, if you go back, it's like 13, like 1300 subs, man. So depending on when you're watching this, man, you know, so I'm just saying, dude, like it's taking me literally a few hundred videos. Okay. And, and today I'm at 1.3 subs. Shout out, shout out to every single one of you, man. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Smash the bell for notifications and give me a, a freaking thumbs up, man. Give me a thumbs up if you find value in these damn videos, man. I'm not doing this for my health. I'm telling you, man, I'm fired up. You guys need to start talking about something and, 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 and keeping it authentic and, and allowing the, the market to, 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 to play you and play you in, a, in, in their favor and play you in a good way and support you and al allow the market to freaking build off of you, you know, attract, you'll attract that market, you know, with, and, and I'm telling you, you're going to do it through YouTube. I'm telling you, I'm fired up to do that through YouTube, doing it on any other social media platform. is a little different. If you're posting and you're going Facebook live and you're doing videos on Facebook, um, whether it's an ad or whether you're just trying to do it organically. Okay. Whatever. Instagram. You post on Instagram, it's lost in the newsfeed three seconds later, 
okay, whatever. You tweet it, okay, it's 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 mixed up in, in freaking Twitter land and, and, and you're just another tweet. It's like, dude, I'd rather take that type of same content, same content I would have put anywhere else. I'd rather just make a simple video on it, a simple video on it. And it could be on anything and you guys could do this on anything. That's what I've been doing. I've been doing that when it comes to, to simple online marketing, social media marketing, affiliate marketing, things that I'm trying, things that I'm doing, things that I'm testing, things that I'm succeeding at. You know what I mean? And, 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 and that's what I'm talking about. And I'm telling you, man, from my little ass niche, from my little, you know, small amount of, 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 of 1.3, shout, shout out to every single one of you, man. 1.3, shout out to every single one of you, man. Much love and respect. Um, but just off of that small amount, man, I'm telling you, that first check today was 291. That, I get this email, I get this email today. What's today? This comes from Google Payment. This came November 21st. Today's November 21st. I got this email this morning and I'm like, dude, okay. And then it says, if you haven't received your payment within five business days from the date of this email, please contact your bank for more details. Well, I was already expecting five days. I wasn't even tripping. I was just tripping in a good way that I was actually getting something. I'm like, what? I'm like, dude, this is crazy. Like, it's not just 30 bucks. Like it's damn near almost 300. Like, dude, it's 291. This is my first YouTube check ever. And, and I can only imagine if I continue to put out content and you freaking amazing people continue to watch my stuff, that number, I'm already projecting that that number will literally go up every single day from this point on. As long as I can keep putting out video, as long as you guys can keep putting out video, that number can grow fast and it grows daily and it compounds, um, it multiplies. And that right there is literally the most powerful form of income I truly believe anyone can build. I truly believe, man. So out of all, whatever all these monkeys are doing on social media, I'm here to tell you, man, here today, gone tomorrow. What you do on YouTube, it gives you the ability to monetize it. It gives you the ability. If I'm going to put some shit out, I might as well get paid on it. If I'm going to talk some smack on something and really bring value and educate and, and like, like I said, that's what I do on my channel, basic tutorials on landing pages. That's what I'm doing. Basic Facebook advertising. That's what I'm doing on this channel. Simple, man. Nothing special at all. But that little niche, that little niche that gravitates to you, they gravitate to the real you. That's your little niche. And I'm telling you, man, it doesn't take that many to, to be successful. It does not, man. Just on this YouTube ad money alone. Are you kidding me? 300 bucks, 291, that will pay for a car payment. Like that is literally a car payment. And, and that's my very first check, man. I can only imagine if I keep putting out videos and that check doubles next month. Like, dude, I'm telling you, that fires me up. To tell you the truth, even if it was $91, I would have still been fired up. The fact that it's 291 and it's my first check, I'm like, dude, that is major. Now I told my wife, I'm like, most people wouldn't have spent the year and a half putting up stuff to see what stuck. Most people wouldn't have done that. So a lot of you guys that are watching this, most of you will not sacrifice and go out there and talk about something and bring your passion into it and document it and throw it up on YouTube and set it all up pretty so it's out there in the YouTube algorithm world and it has the chance to be seen. Most of you won't do that. Most of you won't do a, do a, a video a few times per week for, for, let's just say, two years. Most of you won't even do that two to three times uh, uh, per week videos. Three to, three to, three to three, yeah, three, three videos per week. Most of us can't do that for one year. That consistent, that consistent, that consistent. It's a lot of energy, man. This ain't easy. <laughs> you know what I mean? You got to freaking record the damn thing. But I tell, I tell people all the time, I'm like, dude, don't create. You got YouTube creators, and those are people at 5 million subs. Dude, I'm telling you, at my little amount of subs, dude, 291. Are you kidding me, dude? That's my first check. It's like, dude, I said, I told my wife, I'm like, dude, most people wouldn't have, wouldn't have put in that type of effort and that type of time a year and a half since 2017. I've been trying to put videos up, not even knowing what the heck I'm doing, right? And then, and then, and then, and then a year later, a year and a half later, boom, the check comes and then, and then it, and then it, and then it, it starts to grow. It's a snowball. You're it, this, and, and the snowball is going downhill. 
the snowball is going downhill fast. And when, it, when that happens, that number compounds and that, num that number multiplies, especially when it's in this type of, of, of a, of a, of a, of a um, concept where we're making ad money. Dude, I'm telling you, dude, $300, dude, you could pay for most cars. That's a lease on a freaking nice car, $300. Like, dude, that's, you're telling me you're going to pay me that every, every month, every month. And, 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 and I could possibly increase it by just continually putting out and doing what I'm already doing. It's like, dude, you got to be kidding me, man. I I'm like thinking to myself, I'm like, what's going to happen when I triple that? And, and I got a thousand a month coming in. I got a thousand a month coming in. Dude, do you understand that? Do you, do you understand? I come from mortgages and real estate, man. I know what it takes to put money in the market. Like I know what it takes to make a positive cash flow every month on a piece of real estate, whether it's a residential home and, and you're investing and you're freaking renting and you got tenants and you're a real estate investor and you're out there buying single family. First of all, you got it wrong by buying single family. But if you're buying single family and trying to manage that, it's like, dude, your, your cash flow is not that much. Like I, I told this to my wife earlier. I'm like, dude, do you understand for you to invest in real estate? For you to invest in real estate in San Diego, where we're at, right? If I were to go buy a piece of property right now, a, a normal three-bedroom residential single-family home, if I were to go buy that piece of property right now with the intention of renting it out because I'm a real estate investor, do you understand that the mortgage on that is going to be probably more than what I'm going to be able to get from them? for rent. Do you understand that? Like my mortgage is going to be, is going to be, is going to be a, a, a couple grand. You know, that's how much the rent isn't even that high, but at, but at the same time it is, it is right. Cause that that's supply and demand. So it, it actually is that high, but the fact is, is that even, okay. So that's my point. You buy a piece of property for, let's just say you put 10% down of a $400,000 property there's 40,000 that, that I'm out right now. So 40 grand, boom. I had to come up with that 40 grand just to go buy one single family. I financed the rest, but I run it out. I run it out. And the person that pays me rent every month, they pay, they pay me just enough to make that mortgage payment. And if I were to get a hundred dollars per month on top of that, that's positive cash flow. If the mortgage payment is 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 two thousand a month, and I can charge them twenty three hundred a month, then I make a two thousand dollar mortgage payment, and I make a three hundred dollar positive cash flow, right? So if it, so, if those were the real numbers, and if I really had to do that, if I put down ten percent minimum, ten percent on a four hundred thousand dollar house, because you're not going to buy out here, depending on where you're at, man. A lot of these major cities, I'm in a major city, I'm in San Diego. You can't even buy a shoebox for 200 grand. You know, you can't even freaking, you, you, you can't even get a one bedroom condo for 200 grand. You know what I mean? Like, so a single family, you're paying, you're paying, you're paying 400, 450, 475. And, and so you're telling me you're a real estate investor. Okay, whatever. 10%, that's 40 grand. I put 40 grand down just to rent it to you to barely make the mortgage payment, right? And even if I did charge you a little bit more, what's a little bit more? 300. So if the mortgage payment was two grand and I was charging you 2300, I make a $300 positive cash flow, but damn, I had to come up with 40 grand and I got to carry this debt, right? And, 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 and so, I look at this money, you guys, this is residual income. This, most, most people have no clue about how powerful this money is. This is compounding money, man. People are literally watching my videos and watching, my, and, and watching ads, watching YouTube pre-rolls, watching ads come through the pipeline, come through the algorithm. People are seeing ads on all of these YouTube videos and, and the creator is, is able to monetize. That's freaking powerful, man. And when that number can compound and when that number can freaking multiply fast because you don't stop, you're a machine. You don't stop pushing content. That's what I'm saying, man. You're going to see me come back in a year. You're going to see new videos. Like I'm telling you, I'm not going to stop. How hard is this? Are you kidding me? You know how hard it, that people have to work to go make that much money at work? Like look at your job, dude. How much do you make per, per hour, right? How much do you make per hour? And how long does it take you to make 300 bucks at work? 
net, not tax. I'm not talking about taxes. You're, you know, you get your paycheck and half of it's gone. No, I'm not talking about W-2 earner. I'm talking 1099. I'm talking about this is my little business. It's like, dude, all I'm doing is putting out stuff that I'm already talking about, that I'm already doing, you know, documenting what I'm already doing. That's why I tell my friends, I'm like, no, dude, don't create. You got creators. That's fine. But I always listen to Gary Vee where he just talks about document, document, just document what you're already doing, man. I'm documenting what I'm already doing, right? Like I'm already building landing pages. I'm already building email autoresponders. I'm already, you know, making sales online. I'm already selling books online, courses online. It's like, dude, this is stuff I'm already doing and I'm just simply finding ways to talk about it. That's all. Because I truly believe every business needs what, 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 what I'm fired up about. That's why I'm fired up about it. So keeping it simple, man, but it's like, dude, this right here is real estate money, man. This is what I call digital real estate. That's digital freaking income right there. That's digital income. That's digital passive income, residual income, royalties, rock star money. Though that that's freaking my royalties right there, man. I'm a freaking YouTube rock star, you know, with millions of subscribers. Can you imagine, dude? Look at my little ass channel, you guys. At the making of the video, I have freaking a little over a thousand subscribers. YouTube, you want to pay me that much? I'm down. And that number is gonna only increase from this point on. The more I put out, I am down. You kidding me? How the heck would you guys not want that? Like that's crazy, dude. You guys are freaking. You guys must not like money if you're not thinking that that's a big deal. That's a big deal. How much money do I need invested in real estate to make a positive cash flow of 300 bucks? I'm telling you, man. I put 40 grand down. I rented it to you for 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 2300. I pay the mortgage, 2 grand, I pocket 3. Dude, I don't want to put 40 grand down. I can make some stupid videos like this and freaking start banking this way. Like, dude, that's like, and, and, and that, and, and you're going to passively pay me that I'm down. Like, dude, I'm telling you, man, take your content on a YouTube, take it on a YouTube, man, take it onto YouTube and share it with the world. Whatever you're fired up about, man, other people are fired up about it too. And you guys can learn, you can teach, you can learn, you can, you can monetize, you can build, you can brand, you can freaking change people's lives, man. You never know who the hell's watching your stuff, man. Um, and, and that's what's crazy. But shit, keep watching it, man, because those ads are going to keep spinning and that number is going to keep increasing. So you guys, man, I want to encourage you. Go make your, make, make your channel. Build your channel right now. I'm trying to get my little 12-year-old to build his channel now. It's like, dude, you understand? If you built it now, by the time you're a senior, you'd be crushing it. You know what I mean, you guys? We all have an equal opportunity, man. No matter where the hell you're in the country, you have something to talk about. Talk about it. All right, guys. Over and out. Peace.